Get ready for a busy hurricane season. Today, researchers released their most active preseason forecast ever. This 2022 report comes from Colorado State University. And researchers say they are expecting more tropical storms than normal this year. Our chief meteorologist, Eric Fisher, is back now. And Eric, why so many? Yeah, so Colorado State is known for many, many years for issuing these tropical uh, kind of outlooks for the season. We know it only takes one, so when it comes to the numbers, what really matters to us, to us in the end is how many actually hit land and hit the United States and some of the islands. And so what we're looking at for this season is they're forecasting 19 named storms, previously the most that they had before a season began. Forecast was 18. In 2021, we actually had 21 named storms. The average is 14. They're forecasting nine hurricanes and four major hurricanes. And the reasons that they are forecasting this, you kind of look to the oceans, and they really dictate how the season may go. Well, currently, we're still seeing La Nina conditions in the Pacific. This is the stripe of cooler than average water. What La Nina does is it decreases wind shear in the Atlantic Basin over near us. And when you have El Nino, it's the opposite. There's more wind shear. Tropical systems do not like wind shear. They also are noting that we have a very warm Atlantic Basin here, and they correlate. They look at ocean temperatures from March to March, year to year, decade to decade. What kind of a setup creates active seasons? And everything coming together for another active one this year. First name storm this year will be Alex, then Bonnie, Colin, and Danielle, and down will go throughout the list. The last one of the season would be Walter if we used all the names on the list in 2022.